Hello everyone, welcome to a Friday new product post with Robert here at Sparkfun Electronics. We've got a few new things to talk about and a demo, so let's jump right in and see what we've got for this week. First up, we've got a really, really cool kit for anyone that's interested in both DIY and audio. This is the Moog Verkstat 01. This is a kit-based analog synthesizer from the lovely people at Moog. Um, if anyone is unfamiliar with the name Moog, you, they are the name in analog synthesizers. You know, going all the way back to the 70s, they have kind of defined this product. So this comes as a kit, and I'll pull out the individual pieces to give you an idea of what's inside. This is the case itself. See, it comes with this really nice metal enclosure. So it goes a little something like that. And just a note that this whole kit does not actually require any soldering. So for the electronic noob, it's actually pretty easy to get into. And here is the main circuit board. Look at that. Let's see, it goes a little something like that. So that is the main circuit board. It comes pre-assembled just like that. So really all you need to do is just kind of connect everything up into this enclosure. It even has um, you know, some stickers and some feet for the bottom of the enclosure. And even comes with these nice little assembly instructions that you can see here of everything you need to do to hook it together. Um, the interesting thing about this is that it's designed with hacking in mind. There are a lot of different tutorials. If you check out the product page, you can find the link on there of how to hack this, how to modify it. And we do even carry a mod kit that is an expansion to this that includes a bunch of different parts that you can go in and modify this to suit your needs. So it's a really cool platform if you're looking to get into audio and want to hack around with a synthesizer. Definitely check out this kit the add-on kit, as well as the bundle, which is the add-on kit, and this. Any new Friday product post would not be complete without LEDs, and this week we have some new LEDs for you. These are 3 watt LEDs. These are really powerful, very bright, and we have them in these little five packs. We have them in red, cool white, warm white, and blue. And let me just pull them out and show them to you. These are pretty standard now, um, but these are the star type LEDs that you can see the um, LED is mounted on this kind of like um, star PCB. It's an aluminum backed PCB so as you see on the back that's like an aluminum backing that's on it and it helps for heat transfer and also mounting. And as I said each one of these comes in a five pack so you get five of these LEDs and we have one of our engineers Joel here to show you an application that he used these for and he'll give you a little bit better idea of how to mount these and use these in application. Hi, Joel Bartlett with Sparkfun Electronics. We're here today in my home to show you our new 3 watt high intensity LEDs in action. A few months ago I came across some dart frogs that were for sale on Craigslist. I decided to acquire some, build my own terrarium for them, and plant it. And once it was all finished, I decided I wanted to create my own LED lights for it and also be able to control them to fade them on and off uh, slowly just to replicate the sun. We're here today to show you that in this light fixture that I've made for this terrarium and let's go ahead and take a closer look. Here we can see the underside of the light. Uh, the first thing to note is I have an Arduino Pro Mini controlling everything and on the under underside of the Arduino Pro Mini we have a real-time clock module so that the light can keep very accurate time. Next to that we have the Pico Buck. The Pico Buck is a constant current LED driver that is very important when driving these LEDs. Should one of them decide to burn out or have a short, the constant current driver will make sure that more current isn't delivered to the other LEDs in series. The Pico Buck is rated at about 350 milliamps per channel, leaving us with about three LEDs per channel. One important note when using these LEDs is heat dissipation. It is very important to have a heat sink to attach your LEDs to in order to prevent them from overheating and potentially burning out. Here you can see I have these two bars that were previous samples on these aluminum strips as a heat sink and here we're using some Actobotics 45 degree angle brackets as the heat sinks for the 3 watt LEDs. To attach these I use some of our thermal heat tape 
cut tiny little squares and just stuck it right onto the bracket. In the morning, when the real-time clock realizes it's about 6 a.m., the LEDs will slowly start fading on via a pulse width modulation line here from the Arduino to the Pico Buck. And then in the evening, the process goes in reverse, slowly fading off to replicate the sunrise and sunset. Last, we have one of our 12 volt, 5 volt power supplies running the whole show. The 12 volts goes to the Pico Buck and then powers the LEDs, while the 5 volt line powers the Arduino and the real time clock module. As you can see, using these LEDs is a pretty painless process. All you need is a good heat sink, some thermal tape, a good power supply, and a good constant current driver. And you can do anything from under counter lighting to lighting up a vivarium and having nice healthy plants grow inside. Next up, we've got this big box. This is a SparkFun lab pack. Some of you might not be familiar with lab packs at all. Um, this is the digital sandbox lab pack. We have a few different lab packs on the website and these products are primarily aimed at educators. So you have an educator that wants to teach different technology or wants to teach different classes and they want to buy a large pack of digital sandbox, SIK, or whatever else, and the supporting documentation and like some extra parts to go along with it to teach a large classroom. This is the purpose of a lab pack. For all of you educators out there, we do encourage you to go to learn.sparkfun.com and check out how to become an educator with us. This is the digital sandbox lab pack, as I stated. And inside, you can see that is a bulk pack of a lot of the digital sandboxes. We have all the base plates, we have all the cables, and then over here we have the actual digital sandboxes themselves. This lab pack contains 10 of everything you need. Um, in here we also have the manuals and everything else to host a class with 10 individual students. So definitely check out the lab packs if you're an educator. Um, we have more coming, but right now definitely check out the digital sandbox and also the SIK lab pack. These are your new products for this week. We have the Digital Sandbox Lab Pack as well as the other lab packs on the site. We have the new 3 watt LEDs in the four glorious different colors. And we also have the Moog Werkstatt 01 Analog Synthesizer Kit. We also have more new products on the website, so go ahead and check that out at sparkfun.com. And we'll see you again next week with even more new products.